Learn how you can elevate and take your video to the next level by adding transitions with ClipChamp. Start by logging into ClipChamp or sign up for free. Next, you'll be taken inside the editor. To get started, you'll import the videos you want to add transitions to. Do this by clicking on the Import Media button, selecting the assets, and then clicking Open. Your videos will load into the Your Media Library here. Now, just drag and drop each video into the timeline to get editing. Once all of your videos are in the timeline, there's two ways you can add a transition. The first is to navigate to the toolbar and click into the Transitions tab. The transitions are all categorized to make it easier to find what you're looking for. Scroll through the options, hovering your cursor over the transitions to preview what they look like. Now, if you're using a free ClipChamp account, you can identify the premium transitions by the diamond icon in the top left. Some premium options include fire, liquid drops, and liquid swirl. Once you've found the transition you want to use, drag and drop it into the timeline, placing it between two of your video clips. This will automatically snap the transition into place. Play your video back to see what it looks like. Depending on the length of your videos, a gap may form between your other clips. To remove it, simply right click into the gap and click the delete this gap button to move everything back into place. You can also replace your chosen transition to something else by navigating back to the transitions and dropping another option into the timeline, placing it on top of the previous transition. Again, just play your video back to check the changes. Now the second way to add a transition, which is a little bit quicker, is to head into your timeline, hover your cursor between two of the clips, and click the Add Transition button. Then navigate to the Property panel, click into the Transitions tab, and as you did before, find the transition you want. Simply click on that transition to apply it to your video. Lastly, you can edit the duration of that transition if you'd like. By clicking on the transition, heading back to the Transitions tab of the Property panel, where you'll see the Duration slider. Drag the slider to the left to speed the transition up, or drag it right to slow the transition down. Feel free to adjust each transition as you'd like by following the same steps. Once all of your edits are complete and you're happy with your video, you'll export it by heading to the Export button, selecting your video quality, and once the export is complete, it will download to your device all ready for you to share. And that's how to elevate your videos with transitions. If you like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for our weekly how-to videos.